Mogesalme Bits, we first of all, Shabom. Dress with a trans peer online competencias. Gilots out Armatebs Gisorept. May made the box or Talian Argat Arad Gent Quentemeps. Nada Sakamarisat Mumza de Bulebi Knebit Ari Helvot, Rats Tawaria. Da Ola Peritalian Argat Gam Givat. Picro Brom, Saint Eros, a theme of Tandak of Shirebit, has a technique or at Gamar Tulat, Argad Mumza de Bulli present at Shebi Geknebat, as a rooms armor tebs Gisurwept, Tadaw, it's got Marima Salabello. Ivatono, thank you very much. Now let's begin. Uh, our first presenter will be Natia Bulbulashvili, and now uh, she's gonna to tell about autumn and holidays we will celebrate in autumn. Please, Natia, begin. Hello, I'm Natia Bulbulashvili, sixth grade student. Today I'm going to talk about Arton and his uh, celebrates. Arton. Arton, also known as uh, Foliners American English, is uh, one of the uh, four temperature seasons. Outside the tropics, uh, uh, autumn make, uh, marks the tradition from summer to winter in September or March. Even the uh, direction of uh, daylight become noticeable shorter and the uh, temperature cools noticeable. Autumn. Uh, day late uh, decreases and the night late uh, decreases as the season uh, progress until the winter uh, solstice in December and June. Uh, one of its uh, main features in uh, temperature uh, climates is uh, the shedding of leaves from uh, deciduous trees. Halloween uh, pumpkins. In Halloween, people always make pumpkins. Halloween's history. Halloween evolved uh, from the uh, ancient uh, uh, center holiday of uh, Samhain. Over the uh, centuries, Halloween tra uh, tradition from a pagan uh, ritual to a, a day of parties, customs, deco lanterns, and uh, trick or treating for kids and adults. Uh, Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving uh, is a uh, na uh, national holiday celebrated on uh, various uh, dates in the United uh, States, Canada, Grenada, Saint uh, Lucia, and Liberia. It began as a, a day of giving thanks and a uh, crisis uh, for the uh, blessing of the harvest and uh, of the uh, preceding year. Similarly uh, named festival holidays occur in uh, Germany and uh, Japan. Thanksgiving is ce uh, celebrated on the uh, second uh, Monday of October in Canada and on the first uh, Thursday of uh, November in the United States and around the same part of the year in other places. As well, Thanksgiving has historical roots in uh, religious and uh, cultural traditions. It has long uh, been celebrated as a sacral uh, no holiday as well. Tveli in Georgia. Uh, Tveli, a harvest holiday in Georgia, is a rural uh, days long celebration uh, held every year around uh, September or uh, October, uh, depending on the region. Any insightful uh, traveler will think an uh, insider's uh, Per, uh, perplexes of the uh, ethnic uh, identity, national predations, and uh, a cure essence of the uh, uh, country in which uh, he or she finds them uh, themselves. In Georgia, there is no better way to understand the country and its uh, people than by uh, participating uh, in Twelly. For the lover, sweet melodies, uh, lively dances, good nature jokes, and joyful climates of the uh, holiday are two expresses of Georgia, uh, Georgian uh, character and the core identity uh, of the land. Georgian wine. Georgia is one of the oldest uh, wine region in the world. The fiery uh, valleys and uh, protective uh, slopes of the uh, Transcaucasia were home to grape wine cultivation and uh, Neolithic uh, wine production for at least 8,000 years. Uh, years. Due to the uh, many uh, millennia of the uh, of wine in Georgian history and its uh, prim, uh, 
prominent economic role. Uh, the tradition of uh, wine are uh, considered uh, entwined with and uh, inseparable uh, from the uh, national identity. Um, autumn in Georgia, autumn in America, autumn in Korea, and autumn in uh, Australia. Thanks for watching. I think Not that the it was really very interesting, amazing. Okay, Mrs. Rosidan, um, hello, welcome. Thank you for participating. Dr. Hart, Dr. Hart, and we have the conference. 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 We have the the Sabamisad Veli, Dalian Sainteres of Conferencia, the Gisture, Siamonebas, Santquen in Ashromit, Mirabu Siamonebas, Armat Ebbs, well of Hit Nabis, the Rasatki, Argat Gadat Gant Hobbit. Madlo, but Quens Massaule Blepsa, Kilo of Taba, Quens online conference. The Wusman Uradre. Hello, I'm Daniel de Dorini, da Daniel de Dorini, and I present a presentation about beer. Bears are carnivore members of the family Yursi. They are classified as coniforms or dog-like carnivores. Also, only eight species of bears are extant. They are widespread, appearing in a wide variety of habitats throughout the northern hemisphere and uh, partially in the southern hemisphere. Bears are found uh, on the continents of North America, South America, Europe, and Asia. Common characteristics of modern bears include large bodies with stocky legs, long snouts, small rounder ears, shaggy hair, plenty great paws with five non tricle claws, and uh, short tails. While the polar bears is mostly carnivorous and the giant panda fits almost entirely on the bamboo, the remaining sea species are omnivorous with varied diets, with the expansion of courting individuals and the mothers with their young bears are uh, typically solitary animals. They may be diurnal or nocturnal and uh, have an excellent sense of smell. Despite their heavy build and uh, acquired gait, they are adept runners, climbers, and swimmers. Bears use shelters such as caves and locks at their dens. Most bases occupy, occupy uh, their, their dens uh, during the winter for a long period of hibernation, up, up to 100 days. Bears have been uh, hunted since uh, prehistoric times for their meat and fur. They have been used for beer baiting and other forms of uh, entertainment, such as uh, being uh, made uh, to dance. With their powerful physical pr presence, they play a prominent, prominent uh, role in the arts, mythology, and other cultural aspects of various human uh, societies. Thanks for your attention. Hey, Danny, thank you for your presentation. And are you afraid of bears? Switch your what? sound also. Are you afraid of bears? Uh, for example, if you meet them anywhere in the nature? No. You no, see, they are very huge, they are very strong animals, and they fight. You see, stronger than the maybe the strongest man in history. <laughs> I don't afraid because uh, I, don't, I don't, don't love uh, hunting. Uh -huh. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate, yes. Because uh, uh, I don't like hunting also. Well, thank you. Uh, now next will be uh, Mariam Sopromadze. And she's gonna tell about kinds of islands. Thank you. Now next, Mariam Sopromadze, please introduce Hello, yourself. Hello, I'm sixth grade student, Mariam Sopromadze. Today I have one interesting presentation about islands. Let's begin. An island is an area of land that is surrounded by water. Islands can be found in all bodies of water, from streams and rivers to lakes, seas, and oceans. The two main types of islands are oceanic islands and continental islands. Oceanic islands. Oceanic islands are the tops of 
underwater volcanoes and oceanic islands form uh, when a volcano erupts deep under the ocean and pushes the ocean floor upward into a mountain. The island is the top of the mountain. The Hawaii Islands are example of ocean. Oh. Uh, continental islands. Continental islands are the close to the continent. They are part of the same land uh, that makes up the continent. One way that continental islands form is by the uh, flooding of valleys close the coast. The valleys fill uh, with uh, seawater and the tops of nearby hills then become islands. Long islands uh, which lives off the coast of New York State is a continental island. Hawaii Islands. Hawaii is made up of about uh, 132 islands and islands. Uh, the Hawaii Islands were formed by volcanoes and were built up over millions of years. Hawaii Islands. The island of Hawaii is often called the Big Islands. That is partly because uh, it is the largest of islands. The nickname also helped distinguish if it uh, formed the state as well. Hawaii is the youngest of the islands. It includes Mauna Loa, the world's largest volcano, and uh, Kilauea, uh, one of the world's most active volcanoes. The island is still growing as the lava from uh, Kilauea calls it a uh, hardness and adds uh, to the lands. Hawaii Islands is very beautiful. Long Island. Long Island, I, Long Island uh, Sound was formed over uh, 800,000 years ago. The Long Island uh, Sound was not always an uh, asteroid. It originally only contained fresh water, then about 8,000 years ago, ice that used to keep sea water away uh, failed and salt water from the Atlantic Ocean began to flow into the lake's fresh water. The first person to discover the Long Island Sound was a Dutch navigator named Adrian Block. Coral Island. Coral Island, tropical island built of organic material derived from uh, skeletons of corals and numerous other animals and plants associated with corals. Coral Island consists of low or land, perhaps only a few meters above sea level, generally with coconut palms and surrounded by water White, uh, white coral sand beaches. Uh, they may uh, extend dozens and kilometers of, uh, include almost any tropical limestone island whose structure is in integrally a uh, part of living or uh, relatively. Recent coral reef. Reef building takes uh, place mostly uh, below high tide level and tropical coral island or uh, cay usually uh, surmounts the uh, relatively flat top of the wall reef system. Geologically, uh, the island is just one small part of the wall coral reef. It's, thank you for your attention. Uh, now next will be Luca Gergedawa and I will prepare uh, his presentation. Okay, Luca Gregedava, please, you can start. Information about mountains. Yeah. Hello, my name is Luca Gergedava, and I will uh, and I will presentation about mountains. Mountain Everest, the world's highest uh, highest peak, just grew a couple of feet over nine on paper at least. On Tuesday, after years of fraud discussion and serving work, China and Nepal. Announced a, a, a revision to the elevation of Mount Everest. Officials say the summit now stands precisely 8,840.6 meters or uh, 29,041.69 feet above sea level. Um, Mount Kilimanjaro is a dormant volcano in Tanzania. It, it has three volcanic cones Kiba, Mawenzi, and Shaiva. It is uh, the highest uh, mountain in Africa and the highest single freestanding mountain in the world, 5,895 meters above sea level and about 4,900 meters. Kilimanjaro is the fourth uh, most topographically prominent on years. The first people now to have reached the summit were Hans Meyer and Ludwig, Parcheller in 
1889. It is part of Kilimanjaro National Park and is a major climbing dest destination. Because of its ranking glacier and disappearing ice fields, it has been the subject of many scientific studies. Mount Elbrus is the highest mountain in Europe as the highest peak, uh, peak in the Caucasus. Mountains the dormant volcano rises 5,642 meters above sea level and is the highest stratovolcano in Eurasia and the ten most prominent peak in the world. The mountains stand, uh, stands in southern Russia at the western Caucasus in the Russian Republic of Kabardino Balkaria. Well, thank you for your attention. As you see, one um, of the most famous and nice mountains uh, origin from the eruption of Vulcano, yes? Especially El Bruce. Okay, next. Katie Olashvili, please begin. And she's going to talk about such kind of special kinds of animals in, I think, in Africa or we are, I don't know. Okay, please, uh, Katie, start. Hello, I am Katie Oloshvili, sixth grade uh, student. Today I presentation uh, animals. The animal world is very diverse. They play a big role in the life of man and nature. Unfortunately, uh, many animals are on the verge of extinction, and they are included in the Red Book. It is our duty to take care of them. Today uh, I will talk about four specific animals, rabbits, dogs, lions, and leopards. Rabbits. Male rabbits are called bugs. An older term of an adult rabbit is coney, while rabbit once refers only to the young. I have a one-year-old rabbit. She is a white and fluffy girl. Her name is Lucy. Lucy is very warm and lovely. She is four kilograms. Another term for a young rabbit is bunny. Thought this term is often applied informally, particularly by children to rabbit generally especially domestic ones. More recently, the term kit or kitten has been used to refer to a young rabbit. Dogs. Dogs are mammals. Dogs are highly variable in height and weight. The smallest known adult dog was York's Terrier that stood only six centimeters and the should nine centimeters in length along the head and body and weighed only 113 grams. The most massive known dog was a St. Bernard, which weighed 167 kilograms and was uh, 215 centimeters, from the snout to the tail. The tallest dog is Great Dane, that stands uh, 106 centimeters at the shoulder. Lions. The lion is species uh, in the family, followed and a member of the genus Pantera. It has a muscular, uh, deep chest body, short rounded head, round ears, and a hairy tuft at the end of its tail. The male lion's mane is the most recognizable uh, feature of the species. It starts growing when lions are about a year old. Main color varies and darkens with age. Research shows each color and size are influenced by environmental factors such as average ambient temperature. Leopards. The leopard is one of the uh, five extant species uh, in the genus Pantera, a member of the felid. It occurs in a wide range in sub Sahara Africa, in small parts of Western and Central Asia, a small parts of Europa and Russia, and on the Indian subcontinent to Southeast and East Asia. Thank you for your attention. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Thank you. <clears throat> Uh, sorry, I have one question. Uh, which of you have domestic animals, maybe cat or dog? Can you tell me the name of your pets? Which of you? Teacher, I have only rabbits. Rabbit, really? A oh, little bunny. <laughs> uh, and the name of your bunny? Uh, Lucy. Lucy. Ah, uh, uh, you have wrote about your personal bunny. Yes. Uh, now, any of you? Do you have any dogs or pets? No? I have a dog. Uh, his name is Bobby. <clears throat> Bobby, uh, is it a large or little like this terrier, only 10 centimeters? Uh, it's not large, it's not small. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, mid middle size. He is in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. <clears throat> 
Oh, well, thank you. Now, next. Uh, Pripia Ina Turtumia. Ina, are you ready? You can start. Presentation about mm -hmm. one of the biggest canyon in the world, you see? Grand Canyon. I hope that you have heard about this canyon. Okay, Ina, begin, start, please. Hello, my name is Ina Turtumia. I'm in a sixth grade, and today my presentation will be about the Grand Canyon. The Grand Canyon. Uh, the Grand Canyon is a famous canyon in Arizona formed by the Colorado River. It is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and a National Park of the United States. It is also one of the seven natural wonders of the world. The Grand Canyon is 277 miles long, up to 80 miles wide and is over a a mile deep in places. Nearly two billion years past of the Earth's uh, geological history have been exposed as the Colorado River and its tributaries cut their channels through layer after layer of rock. Evidence suggests the Colorado River established its cause uh, cars uh, through the canyon at least uh, 70 million years ago. Since that time, the Colorado River continued to erode and from the canyon to the point we see it at today. Local erosion in the western Grand Canyon began about 70 million years ago, but a through flowing Colorado River to the Pacific Ocean did not exist until about 5.4 million years ago. Most of the uh, downward uh, cutting has been concentrated in the last 2.5 million years. The result of all the erosion is one of the one of the most complete geologic columns on the planet. There are nearly four, uh, 40 major sedimentary uh, rock layers exposed in the Grand Canyon and in the Grand Canyon in a National Park area. They uh, range in age from about 200 million to nearly 2 billion years old. Many people come from around the world to visit the Grand Canyon. People uh, can also take trips floating on the, canyon, on the uh, Colorado River in boats and rafts. Some people like to hike in the Grand Canyon. Uh, the land on the north side of the Grand Canyon is called North Rim. The land on the south uh, side of the Grand Canyon is called the South Rim. North uh, Rim is open to visitors from May to October. It is uh, possible to visit South Rim all year round. And there are uh, trails leading from the North Rim and the South Rim to the bottom of the canyon. These trails lead to uh, a place at the bottom of the canyon called a Pantham Ranch. Pantham Ranch has a, a campground and cabins where hikers can spend the night. Some uh, people also ride mules into the Grand Canyon. Most people who visit the Grand Canyon drive in cars to the south rim and just look at the canyon from the rim and take pictures. There are also uh, free shut shuttles for visitors. They uh, are a good way uh, to go from one viewpoint to another. Many tourists like to fly over the canyon on a helicopter have, uh, and have a pan panoramic view. Grand Canyon admission is uh, $35 per, per car. People accessing by foot or bicycle have to pay $20. Admission to the Grand Canyon is in, included uh, in National, national parks and uh, federate uh, recreational lands annual pass, which is valid to enter a national park in the United States for a year. Thank Thanks you. for attention. Uh, thank you, Ina. It was really amazing because, as we know, it's one of the biggest canyon. Yes, because it's one of the biggest canyon. Yes, because it's one of the biggest canyon. 
Ոչ մոյ իսուրվ եպ դիտի մայիվան զետ ատ գոմաս, որոմ էլի չուշի սարիս գամքիրու ալետա, ծարմոյդ գենտրով կիլոմետր նախիվ ուի սիղմիս ատ կվիշ առապերի առա։ Այդս։ Կեքն է մոդը ծորելի։ Այդս we have presentation about caves of Georgia also, and the next Jordan Yash really will present the caves. But now, um, Tekla Toria will talk about one of the prettiest flower tulip. And what do you know about the tulips, origin of the tulips? Please, uh, Tekla begin. Introduce yourself. Hello, my name is Tekla, and I prepared a presentation about the wonderful flower tulip. I think it will be interesting to hear the story about the tulip festival, which is annual in Turkey. The tulip originally grew wild far, far away in the cold Himalayan mountain range. Sultan Suleiman was the first person to collect salty wheat and breed the tulip. Eventually, the tulip came to be a fixture in Turkish culture. Well, indeed, the word tulip came from the Persian word meaning turban, because the tulip's beautiful petals looked like the forts of a turban. Fact about tulip. Tulips are said to have different meanings, based of flower color. Red tulips represent true love. No wonder tulips are the second most popular Valentine's Day flower. White ones are a symbol of apology and mm -hmm. forgiveness. Purple, forgiveness. Purple tulips are a symbol of royalty. The flower tulip is the symbol of Turkey. It brings peace to the people. Turkish people are celebrating Tur Tulip Festival annual in spring. The people are decorating all gardens and squares with tulips. All city is colorful and amazing. You can find tulips all colors of rainbow. More than 13 million tulips are planted every year across the city in Istanbul. Names. The tulips have different names, such as ballerinas, aladins, and others. At the annual tulip festival, you can find the largest tulip carpet in the world. Thanks for watching. You see, it was really, really amazing. Pausha, boy, how am I interested? Some of the cartoons with Piero Chans, to me, was guy gone. Rodis had taken a mitra or Amza de Presentatia Stitebze. Ratom has Megonaru Gak at the Hollandia, the Arvitsirato. I give him the met comments. I don't know if you said that's a trip de Gota. It every Hollandia stand Arab Turket and Magal Tatra. Nam do lots the Imden at serious what Marla Utsoi was Masala. Aranaerat, Veranaerat, Vers Armomis Gero, Turketi, Saris, Export, Yori, Amt, Itabis, Tumsa, Tekla, Shentro, Itso, and Chuen, Sane Mamtemas, Asset was Vamza, David, Armit Com, Shentro, Shegnebulatros, it was a Anuarda Vneuli, Avitali, and Sain Tereso Informatia, Magram Zogadat, Holland, the Arim, Soplioshi, given Netherland, Debi, Piro, Ladgilzi, Asset Quad Game of the Pizzere Bulian, Asset Quad Squadas, what Ipis, Gisha Bisahe, Bisan, Itabis, Asset Quad Export, Shida, Alba Turketi, Meori, Adgilzi, Albat tradiciuli kada datu irtua kufro Turkey chi magam anum sopliu ano arset kada vaich robis kutri tano Hollandia tgas piro atgozeda tit kmis teritori samuz dati procent im klient Hollandia chi sulais didi uzar mazari tit ebis plantat siebia arts mengo ni zalen sa interesa i kunda zalen i zalen la mazi foto e bit kunda efekt ori prezentat siya i ko sakma o tis sa siya monat mosas menita visual urat. Okay, thank you. Now next, um, George Onyashvili will talk about caves, caves of Georgia. Hey, Georgi, are you ready? Yes. Okay, you can Hello, start. Hello, my name is 
Hello, my name is George Onyashvili. Today, I have a presentation about caves. What is it? A cave is an opening in the ground that is caused by natural geological activities and man. The sizes and variety in the rock depends largely on the geogra geographical location. Most caves and caverns refer to limestone, but it includes sea caves, rock shelters, and grottoes, lava tubes, etc. Uh, caverns always have natural light. Caves have zero light. How are they formed? Generally, the combination of soil level rock flow on water and time contributes the formation of cave. Rainwater combines with carbon dioxide uh, that creates mild carbonic acid. This carbonic acid flows into cracks of either limestone, shelf, dolomite, marble, and salt, which is distressed enough to create a greater flow of water. Prometheus Cave in Georgia. Prometheus Cave uh, formed in Satapliets uh, Kaltubo. The total weight of the cave is about 11 kilometers, of which uh, 1,060 meters are open in the visitors. The cave has a to uh, total of uh, 22 hells, six of which are currently open to tourists. Prometheus Cave History. The, the cave was discovered and studied by Georgian Speleogites uh, in the early 1980s. Uh, it is part of a large cave system united by one underground river. Currently, about 30 uh, kilometers of the river ha has been uh, investigated, which is about half the light of the entire cave system. In 1985, the conversation of the cave into scientist tourist designation began. By 1989, a a pedestrian route, route was uh, laid in the cave for about one kilometer. Uh, stairs and paths were built and a 150 uh, meter tunnel uh, was punched out and uh, the exit and construction of ground floor buildings began. The cave was equipped as a reserve, temporarily lighting and small groups of tourists started to visiting. In 1990, uh, due, to, due to the uh, collapse of uh, Soviet Union and a uh, lack of funds, the project was closed. Uh, for several years, a local uh, citizen protect, protected the cave from uh, vandals as memories by a statue of him and his dog in the cave in trains. In 2007, uh, 70 years after uh, the close of the pro project, the Georgian authorities uh, returned to the idea of the conversation of the cave into a tourist designation once again. Uh, President of Georgia, who visited cave in 2010, gave an impetus uh, to the cave transformation into tourist object and uh, suggested a new name, Prometheus Cave, Science the legend legendary and cute. Protagonist uh, Prometheus was changed to the mountains uh, approximately in this area. Uh, local legends makes uh, Prometheus uh, enchanted uh, to the loves of the uh, family, uh, begin uh, perpetually uh, portrayed by a raven. In a year, he was uh, refinished and uh, repented uh, to visitors on May 26, 2011. Sataplia. The Natural Park uh, Park uh, Sataplia was founded in 1905 uh, to protect a uh, recently discovered uh, karst cave with uh, exotic uh, stalactites and stalagmites, as well as uh, Cochian Forest, uh, geological and archaeological sites uh, park was is
expanded to its present uh, borders in 1957. In 2010 and 2011, the South Korea managed reserve was uh, developed to accommodate tourist uh, visitor center was built a coffee house in the middle of the park a small uh, museum a uh, small park with dinosaur cliff uh, food Timur, uh, the main uh, cast uh, he was equipped with lighting effect and secure food space of the total area of uh, 350 uh, 348 hectares are constated with a forest Ref, uh, relief of the um, a landscape in mount, mountains. The reservation uh, featured a clutter of an um, Exing volcano, a site of remains of a man of the Stone Age and uh, fossilized uh, traces and of dinosaurs. The largest cave of Sataglia was discovered in 1925 and it is about uh, 900 meters long. Thank you for your attention. Okay. Thank you. Uh, next, <clears throat> in our, uh, now uh, our next presenter, uh, Nini Gogokia, will show us a little surprise. And if you guess, we'll be uh, very attentively, okay? Please begin, Nini. Hello, I'm Nina Gogokia, sixth grade so student, and I will presentation about Australian animals. There are so many interesting animals in Australia. Four out of five animals that live in Australia only can be found there. Among the animal species that can only be found in Australia are the monotremes, which are mammals that lay eggs. The platypus and two species of Echina are the world's only egg-laying mammals, so-called monotremes. Platypus. The platypus is one of the monotremes. Uh, the egg-laying animal lives along the river, banks in burrows, with a bill like a duck as well as a tail like a beaver. It looks really unique. A platypus can grow up to 60 centimeters in length. Echidna. The echidna is also a monotreme, which only grows up to 40 50 centimeters in length and weighs about 5-6 kilograms. The echidna has spines on the body. It is covered with a prickly coat. The monotreme has a long sticky tangle and eats mainly insects. When the echidna frightened, it rolls into a small ball to protect itself. Australia has almost 400 mammal species and about 140 species of marsupials. A marsupial is an animal that carries the young in her patch. Kangaroo. There are about 50 million kangaroos living in Australia. There are 55 different species of kangaroos. Willoughbys are usually smaller. That uh, kangaroos, but kangaroos come in all sizes. Some weigh only little and are tiny, others weigh up to 90 kilograms. In many rural areas, kangaroos roam in bushland. One of the best places to experience kangaroos is Pebble Beach, a four hour drive south of Sydney. Tasmanian Devil. The Tasmanian Devil is an endangered animal and can only be encountered in the wild on the island of Tasmania, off the southern coast of Australia. The black-coated animal is a tail, uh, is uh, a small dog, but very shy. And the Tasmanian Devil is nocturnal. Nocturnal means the um, animal is active during the nap. Tasmanian devils are the largest carnivorous marsupials and have powerful jaws and teeth. Dingo. Dingoes are the biggest carnivorous mammals in Australia. Carnivorous means meat-eating. Meat Dingo looks similar to a domestic dog, but has a longer muzzle, larger pointed ears and sharper teeth. It has a brown furry coat and bushy tail. Dingoes are wild dogs that feed mainly on small animals. 
Some of the birds that live in Australia can only be found there. Among the typical Australian bird species are the kookaburra. This is the kookaburra. This bird is the world's largest kingfisher bird and grows up to 46 cm, 80 from beak to tail. The kookaburra is known for its chuckling voice, which sounds like human laughter. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Okay. Now next we will talk about Easter. Yes, I know that all Georgian and all Orthodox celebrate today's holiday. And please, Anna Tevdorashvili, introduce yourself and talk about the Easter. Please. So my name is uh, Anna Tevdorashvili, a sixth grade student, and I have uh, prepared a, a presentation uh, for Easter. Let's start. Uh, Easter is a very important uh, festival for our uh, Orthodox Christian world. Its celebration in uh, Georgia is special. This festival is a uh, celebration of coming uh, to life, live again of Jesus Christ. Uh, most important days of of this festival uh, are Monday, uh, Thursday, and Good Friday. Uh, when is Easter? Uh, the date, uh, date uh, of Easter chants uh, every year. Easter always fall on Sunday. This year, Orthodox uh, Easter will fall, fall on Sunday, May, uh, May 2, uh, 2021. Easter traditions in Georgia. The uh, Calitrace uh, patron of Georgia, Ilya, uh, search sometimes uh, this washing of, of the feet. Uh, for, feet. Uh, Kalimanion, uh, ceremonial after uh, worship, uh, even song of Monday, Tuesday. Uh, he washed the uh, Feet of uh, twenty search uh, sevens like Jesus had done. Uh, Good Friday is very important day for all Orthodox Christians. In this day, urge family. Uh, find this X in red on Good Friday. Some people uh, even faint of on this X. Uh, on the um, evening uh, of Holy Thursday, uh, just before Easter comes, uh, churches are uh, crowded after making it uh, difficult to uh, access them. Uh, a lot uh, of people uh, attended the uh, special Easter service uh, conducted by uh, Catholicos Partiak of Georgia and Ilya search in the Cantor or Church of Tbilisi. Uh, on Easter, Georgian's great uh, edge of uh, of which the word Christian is risen. The, then the uh, answer answer comes in that uh, people uh, can uh, pass, uh, test uh, homemade pasta, Easter cake, cake uh, and Easter red eggs in uh, each family. Thank you for your uh, attention. Okay, Maslova. Thank you, Anna. Now next, Anna. Uh, we will talk about Antarctica. Liliana, please, are you ready? Yes. Hello, my name is Liliana Pindishuli, and today I'm going to talk about Antarctica and Antarctic animals. Let's start. Antarctica is Earth's southernmost continent. It contains the geographic South Pole and is situated in the Antarctic region of the Southern Hemisphere, almost entirely south of the Antarctic and Antarctic Circle, and is surrounded by the Southern Ocean. And uh, 14 million 200 thousand square kilometer, it is the fifth largest continent and nearly twice the size of Australia. At 0 0.0008 people per kilometer, uh, kilometer, it is uh, by far the last uh, densely populated continent. 
About 98% of Antarctica is covered by ice that average 1.9 km its thickness, which extends to all but the northernmost reaches of the Antarctic Peninsula. Antarctica, on average, is the coldest, driest, and windiest continent and has the highest average elevation of all continents. Most of Antarctica uh, is a polar desert, which annual precipitation of uh, 200 mm along the coast of, uh, coast of uh, fireless um, Antarctic animals. Antarctic, co Antarctic continent, a hold of title of coldness place on Earth. Only few species of animals are found in Antarctica because of expensive ice covered strong cold wind and lacks of uh, winter sunlight. Uh, emperor penguin. Emperor penguins are of all species of uh, penguin endemic of Antarctic region. Adult penguins have highest up to 45 inches, width between uh, 40 to 45 kilograms. Emperor penguin shows many cooperative behavior to escape from cold wind that reach up to minus uh, 62 degrees Celsius. They group together to conserve warmth. Emperor penguins are the only species of penguin that uh, been in winter season in Antarctica. A uh, killer whale. A uh, killer whale are a uh, tallest whale found in all ocean, including uh, an Arctic region. They hunting for prey, ranging from fishes, penguins, sails, and even other whales. The legs of uh, killer whales measured up to 9.5 meters and weighs between 10 to 11. <laughs> A killer uh, whale, killer whales, a uh, killer uh, whales are very common in the Sea of Antarctica. Have population of uh, seventy thousand, but in winter they migrated away from cold water for Antarctica. Weddell sail. Weddell sails spend much of their time below the Antarctic ice. They have the southernmost uh, ring of any sail, but find the uh, chilly wet waters rich with the prey they seek. These sails do not migrate it often and are uh, commonly found with, uh, within a few miles uh, of their birthplace. Whale sails are very vocal. Their calls can be heard from uh, uh, for a top uh, ice even when sails uh, themselves are below water. And now let's see a short uh, video about how animals survive uh, in cold and uh, windy uh, Antarctica. Hello friends, today we will learn about how animals survive in Antarctica. Oh, it's freezing cold here. You are fully covered, haha. -ha. The most common question asked about the animals in Antarctica is how do they survive with the extreme cold circumstances that are found there. Animals that live in Antarctica have special adaptations that allow them to survive in the extreme conditions. Let's learn about them one by one. Thick, waterproof, and windproof coats. Many Antarctic animals like emperor penguins have either a waterproof or windproof coat. They have four layers of scale-like feathers. These layers overlap each other and form a very good protection from the wind. Blubber layers. Ah, look at these seals. Um, seals and some penguins have thick fat layers called the blubber layers. Their effect is like covering yourself in a blanket, but on the inside. Some animals like sea otters are able to reduce blood flow to the blubber layers. The further the blood is from the surface of skin, the less heat is lost. Small extremities. An extremity is a limb or appendage of the body, particularly the feet and hands. These are the first places to feel cold in winter. Antarctic animals like emperor penguins and elephant seals have tiny bill and flippers, which means less blood is required for these areas and thus less heat is lost. Behavioral adaptations. Behavioral adaptations are the things animals do to survive. 
Um, for example, orca whales travel in the group of about 40, and this togetherness keeps them warm and can reduce heat loss by up to 50%. Swarms can have approximately 10,000 to 35,000 individuals per cubic meter of seawater, and in the harsh winter they are found beneath sea ice which keeps them warm. Special Adaptations by Emperor Penguins they are highly adapted to cold environment as Emperor Penguin is the only animal that breeds during the Antarctic winter. Emperor Penguins have nasal chambers which recover much of the heat lost through breathing process and closely aligned arteries and veins. Now you know how hard the life is in Antarctica. Um, if you would like to help the animals, you can reduce carbon emissions which lead to global warming. Some very simple measures include using energy saver appliances, buying locally grown produce, recycling, etc. <coughs> Stay tuned for more videos. Bye bye. And now let's see a short video about Antarctica. Thank you. <coughs> it was worrying. Really yeah. <laughs> Hello, my name is Gega. My topic is Australia. I'm a sixth grade student. Let's start. Australia. Australia's official, the Commonwealth of Australia is a sovereign country comprising the mainland of the Australian continent, the island of Tasmania, and numerous small islands. It's the largest country in Oceania and the world's sixth greatest 
largest country by total area. The population of 26 million is highly urban and heavily concrete on the Asian seaboard Australia seaboard. Australia's capital is Canberra, and its largest city is Sydney. The countries of the major metropolitan areas are Melbourne, Brisbane, Perth, and Adelaide. Uh, in Australia, there are many strange creatures and animals. In Australia, there are cat, push, kangaroo, and koala. On Australia, of course, is deposit animals such as kangaroo or koala. The platypus, sometimes referred to a red dark belt platypus, is the same quick egg lying mammal endemic to Asian Australia. Uh, including Tasmania. The platypus is the sole living resprinting of its family and genus. So a number of related space appear in the fossil record. Now uh, we see how cute was this animal. of Australia comprises a vast assemble of clan species is timber to over 20,000 vascular and 40,000 non-vascular non plants, uh, 250,000 species of fungi and over 3,000 ranges. The flora has strong offerings with the flora of Gondwana and below the family level has a highly endemic and the spare floor was diversified or shaped by the effects of continent a continental drift and climate change signs are critical. In Australia, there are thousands of kinds of fish. They are butterfly fish, lionfish, parrotfish, clawfish, and other. They are very beautiful, but they can be poisonous, such as lionfish. Clawfish hide in poisonous corals. Corals defend clawfish from carnivores. Poison cat hard clownfish because clownfish is defended by his skin. Uh, the Great Barrier Reef is the world's largest coral reef system, composed of, of over 2,900 individual reefs and 900 islands stretched for over 2,300 kilometers over an area of approximately 3,044 a thousand to four hundred square kilometers. The reef is located in the coral sea of the coast of Queensland, Australia. The Great Barrier Reef can be seen from outer space and is the world's biggest single structure made by living organisms. The reef structure is composed of and built by billions of tiny organisms known as the coral polyps. It supports a wide diversity of the life and was selected as a world heritage site in, in 1981. CNN labeled it in the one of the seven natural wonders of the world. The Queensland National Trust name is a state icon of the Queensland. Australia's greatest country is Sydney. Sydney TV Tower, which is highest in the city, it is 305 meters in Sydney. In Sydney is a beautiful opera house. The Sydney Opera House is a multi-venue performing arts center at Sydney Harbour, located in Sydney, New South Wales, Australia. It is one of the 20th century most famous and distinctive buildings. Now we see how beautiful is Sydney at night.
you thanks for watching okay giga thank you it was really really very amazing and i'm in a good mood now and i want to travel in some foreign countries <laughs> Okay, Liliana. Uh, Liliana helps it, so I'll be Mary. Yes, she needs another set here who never sleeps. Ah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> what are they? They are dancing every night, yes? It's <laughs> okay. <laughs> Dalian Pera Dean, Dan Raval Perovan in presentation, she must have a gig. I'm Dalian Momit. Our last presentation, uh, training conferences, the uh, Bolo presentation. და ძალიან ესეთ მხიარულ ნოტაზე დავასრულებ სახაწლო თემით დიაქ ძალიან ძალიან საინტერესო თემა please torniki sikharulize present new year yes uh, hello my name is torniki sikharulize today i'm gonna present you about uh, projects that i prepared about new year and christmas new year and christmas new year New Year's Day is a holiday in many countries. It was created to welcome the New Year. In most countries, a New Year Day is celebrated on 1st January. I say New Year is an event uh, that happens when a culture uh, celebrates the end of one year and the uh, beginning of the next. Cultures uh, that measure early calendars all have New Year celebrations. Uh, earlier, it was a Roman calendar which was having only only ten months and designated a first March as the a new year. In the Georgian calendar, there are twelve months in every year, and the new year falls on January first, uh, which is widely accepted and uh, celebrated the festival. Uh, this is what the new year looks like in Georgia. Uh, Christmas. Christmas is a well-known Christian holiday set in December, celebrated the world over and famed uh, for its decoration and Santa Claus. Uh, the Christmas means feast day of Christ. Uh, Christ. Uh, it is a uh, yearly uh, celebration marking Jesus Christ's birth. Uh, it is observed on the 25th of December as a cultural and religious celebration among a lot of people all over the world. Uh, Christmas is celebrated in all Christian countries, but there are differences in the way each nation celebrates its date. In Georgia, Christmas is celebrated in uh, 7th January. Chichi Login. Uh, I am from Georgia, specifically from Guria. In Guria, people are uh, celebrating New Year and Christmas especially. Uh, they are each Chichi Login in every family. They are calling it Georgian Christmas tree too. Chichi Login is made uh, of a dry hazelnut or walnut branches that are shaped to form a small conifer uh, tree. Uh, these are some photos of Chichi Login. Korean pie. Uh, at Christmas in Korea, they are mar uh, making Korean pies in every family. Uh, this is a Korean tradition. A Korean pie is similar to Hachapuri and uh, has the shape of ser a serpent. Uh, here are some photos of Korean pie. Oh. <laughs> and next, uh, uh, now. Uh, now we are going to see uh, a video about uh, New Year and Christmas celebrations. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
just hide behind redemption and honesty It's a one-way gate to hell Happy New Year! <laughs> Thanks for your attention. I hope you enjoy the project. I prefer. Word to be word to be met. Thornik has gone to buy some material. The camera that she made this response. Come over, Chine. Now to the test is very difficult. I'm going to school. She wrote that I'm acting. I'm going to do a gig. We're going to have to go on stage. 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 Zalian aktivura tikne ba es procesi se ugana xlebuni. Mi uxeda otim saro zalian mos antekla klubepšit stauša tagnišna da cota še ili bazogiert mam upirata soba magvis versijas mi ani čoskolme skolašit zalian aktivura dugo kuskolme sa hart slogonistije bebi. Da sva da sva projekte bi da vi koni otro mama valcer susta tam režim še vikne bi. Tematika je zalian sa interesa da me tam hleba li amas ole belit ko. Muzika Gisur ebs darmat ebs, gisur ebs bednir ahalz elz, da bednir dhebs, da mshvido bian sartavari. Hlak se da guru khvezel se mart čemit mogu gojni, da čemit kao kese. Hoda mec ina da de mamaks ohod da obrundet da erti guru li khvezel ebis sagamo mawat. Hod ima in zemain šobas unda bi virtua, tordi gero gor pikrom še. Kavak je to, kavak je to, že se ti rád sa interesuje, čo ani tradície bys dre, čo je chov, aby lebys festivaly da uvám rád sa interesuje, ako vysiť, aby bylo ako to. Ertko, že budeš vidieť, čo ani tradície bys, že ukryť bod, že ti dre mi uzdú, že čo ani tradície bys darmo, že na tej, že guru lichu je zle byť čau, to to, že da mi už to dve mrie lát bol. Kaj chalík. Dali je tu dve madloba. Madloba, madloba, koľas. Pavšieš mať, ale bez tam, kauč. Ալիամաս ավլել ասացրով ամթավիս ու պալ դղես, դկո ենթան էրթատարիստա, դկո ենթան գադիս ու այլային պրոբլեմաս դուկ այլային սիխարուս, ռասաս դկո են գանիցտի։ Մի խարխարդ զալի անդա բետների դղեղբի։ Մատլոբա լիա, Մատլոբա մար